We're gonna do, uh, again, the Chromecast, just tapping on Office TV. And it will ask you if you wanna change the ratio to fit the whole screen, which is kinda of cool. So we're gonna hit change. That's a new thing it didn't used to do before. Full screen on phone, black bars will appear on the content. So you can choose if you want the full screen to show, uh, look like the phone, or full screen on a connected device. So we'll just go full screen on phone. And we're, we're already mirrored, we're ready to go. So at this point, everything I'm doing is gonna show up on the TV and I could show any app. I can open up YouTube right now, for example, if I wanted to play a YouTube video and they're all gonna show um, just like that. Now, here's the thing. If you're mirroring your screen because you're trying to show uh, a video through YouTube or Netflix or Hulu, uh, I don't recommend you using this method. This method, mirroring your screen is great if you have like pictures on the phone, for example, you wanna show from a trip, or you have a game or something that's on the phone and you're trying to show the game mirror directly to the TV. That's when I would use this method. If you're just trying to watch a video, I'm gonna show you a much easier way to do it. And again, this applies for the Chromecast and the Roku. So first, let's swipe down and look for the option that says casting screen and you tap there and we're gonna tap there, tap on Office TV, and that'll disconnect it from mirroring, so now it's not mirroring anymore. So here's what you wanna do. You actually wanna go right to the video, so I'm gonna open YouTube, and this will be the same for YouTube, Netflix, or Hulu. Um, go ahead and pause the video, and actually, let's go back, try it again. So here's the video. Let's skip the ad here, and then you'll see what we need to look at. Okay, so in the upper right corner of the video, we have this little icon. This is your cast icon. By tapping on this, you can just send the video right to the TV without having to mirror the whole screen. So I'm gonna tap Office TV, and now the video is gonna play on the TV, and that's it. The video play on the TV, and I can continue to use my phone to do other things. And to me, that's what I like better, not being stuck where my whole screen is mirrored and now I can't see anything else on my phone. So that's a much easier way to mirror content from your phone. And when you're done, just like I did right here, we just swipe down. Here's our video. There's a little arrow right above the play button. If you tap there, it'll open up the settings bigger and then you can hit the X and you can close it. So that's just a really easy way to mirror any type of video from your phone. Again, if you're trying to mirror something that's not a video, then do the original method that I showed you, which is just using Smart View, and then anything that's on your phone will show up on the TV, okay? And again, the process is exactly the same for Roku. You swipe down, go to your left, Smart View, and it will just tap on the Roku option instead of the one that was for Chromecast. And the only difference for Roku is that um, once you tap it on the phone screen, you will need to tap on your remote and approve the Roku to accept your phone sending something to the TV. So that's the only difference. So make sure you have your Roku remote ready, you can hit accept, and then you will be able to mirror it right to the TV. Hope you guys did find that helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and make sure you also follow us on Instagram at h2techvideos for monthly giveaways and a bunch of other cool stuff. Thanks again for watching. Take care and have a good one. Also, I'll leave a link in the description of some Roku devices in case you don't have one. You can easily pick one up.